Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's G from Happiness and Crafting. So today is Friday freebie day. We are on number 51. Um, and today I've just done you a lovely collage sheet. Now, this can be used for absolutely anything. Um, so it sort of like goes as well with the Vintage G theme that we had the last couple of weeks. Same sort of colours. And this will go with majority of of projects that you're you're doing and i think it's absolutely lovely so it's really nice so it's just one sheet i've got some dictionary paper behind and then i've got some sort of like postcards and bits of ephemera on there um which i think looks really really nice so i'm going to show you what i've made today um i don't have a tutorial because again i just can't seem to fit enough hours in my day i could do with a few more um, so I have made a little sort of like journal thingy um, which has got three little pockets like that I've got a journal in the middle um, which I think looks really nice I think this looks like 10 or 12 pages in there um, and then I've got the little pocket so here's a little first little pocket I've made a little tag to go inside now what I've done the little um, elements that I've got on top are from my fussy cuts so um, they go really really well on there so you could they just blend in so well um, because the background is collage you can just add anything to it um, which I think looks really nice so that's a little pocket there which I'm going to pop that back in if I can um, so I've just got a little bit of a cluster there uh, a little fussy cut this one I popped the lovely little birdie one on there with a little bit of um, cheesecloth on there um, and in this one I've got some tags from last week so they do go with it as well um, so that's just a little pocket like that and then I've got a little bit of a cluster up there and then one of my fussy cuts on there so this is the page and I think it looks really really lovely and then I've got a nice big journal card in here um, and then I've just added so it just shows that you can add whatever you like on the top and make it look different each time um, so you could add butterflies and flowers and roses and all sorts of things bits of trim on there uh, but I think that looks really nice so that's a lovely big pocket in there so I will be doing a tutorial on this one because I liked it I just sort of like made it up as I went along um, but it came out really nice so I will probably do a couple of bits a little bit different um, but I will do a tutorial because it's quite a simple easy one to do um, and I think it looks really nice I'm loving the, the little pockets um, with the um, little side opening like that so that's the journal I did then I made some lovely tags so what I did I just cut the piece of paper up um, I cut it in half and then I cut it into three so let's pop these out so that say that's your piece of paper all as I did I cut it down the middle and then I just cut three um, more little um, cuts in it um, so then you end up with eight lovely tags um, again I've just added some of my little fussy cuts on there uh, the words and phrases little butterfly and I think I just backed it with a little bit of tea stain paper which I think look really really lovely so each one is sort of like you can make completely different so this is ideal for a man's card um, and that's a very feminine one um, so you can make them look completely different there's another one with a little bit of um, fabric hanging off with a little bit of um, the same fabric down there so it's like little clusters this one I've just got a little bit of um, cheesecloth underneath one of the little pictures and a little bow and some of the little rose trim on there and look at that one that's so so pretty really pretty on there so they are so simple to make and you can have lots and lots of different designs on there this is one of our little flowers that we made I've got a tutorial on that um, so it, they do mix and match with all sorts of things so I think they are really really lovely um, so simple to do and then the other thing I did um, I took one piece of paper and I made three lovely envelopes so I got two smaller ones and a larger one so and then I've just added some of the little fussy cuts so you can just add whatever you like to them 
um, to embellish them and then I just pops a little closure like that on it um, oopsie daisy which they just open up and I just sew down the sides so they are so so simple um, and I think they look really lovely um, and a nice addition to any any journal that you've got so you could also decorate them with whatever journal that you're making you can just add a little bit of the um, paper or embellishments to it and they will go really well and then I've got two of the little ones this one's I pop butterflies on and that one's I've just got a little um, water lily with a dragonfly on there and it's just a little opening like that so I think they are so cute and so simple to do lots of tutorials on how to make these um, and they're quite quite simple um, and I think they're lovely so that's what I have made with the papers this week um, I hope you like the paper I think it's really nice and I think it will probably blend in with a lot of your um, work um, or other papers that you have and I think they look really nice so there we go guys I hope you enjoyed that um, please please do share your your pictures and your makes on the Facebook group um, because I do absolutely love to see them um, this is the paper that you're going to get this is in the files on the Facebook group if you're not in the Facebook group um, there is a link down below to join um, and if you're not actually on Facebook um, these will eventually be in my Etsy store um, at a very very um, low cost just to cover my Etsy fees so that everybody is um, can get hold of them so there we go guys thank you so so much for joining me please have a fantastic weekend stay safe and take care of yourselves okay guys bye bye